introduction to IAM or Identity Access Management. At the present time, there are some 60,000 MNCs worldwide controlling more than 500,000 subsidiaries. Each of these MNCs employ hundreds and thousands of employees with several digital assets. These people also hold roles that define the level of access that they can get to certain kind of documents, digital assets, etc. You can imagine the level of complexity that pertains to this digital asset allocation, security and authorization process. This is where IAM or Identity and Access Management comes in. Simply put, IAM is a framework of multiple policies that work in parallel, facilitating the management of digital assets and identities. The eventual goal of IAM is to provide single sign-on systems, two-factor authentication, multi-factor authentication, and privileged access management. Let us first understand how important is IAM. Importance of IAM. Businesses, leaders, and IT departments are under increased regulatory and organizational pressure to protect access to corporate resources. As a result, they can no longer rely on manual and error-prone processes to assign and track user privileges. IAM automates these tasks and enables granular access control and auditing of all corporate assets on premises and in the cloud. IAM, which has an ever-increasing list of features, including biometrics, behavior analytics and AI, is well suited to the rigors of the new security landscape. While IT professionals might think IAM is for larger organizations with bigger budgets, in reality, the technology is accessible for companies of all sizes. Let us now understand the components of IAM. Number one, a system that identifies individuals within a system. Number two, ways to identify role as well as assign roles of individuals within the system. Number three, managing roles for need-based updation, creation, deletion within the system. Number four, assigning levels of access to multiple users at once. And number five, scrutinizing internal as well as external system security. How to choose IAM providers? IAM vendors range from large companies such as IBM, Microsoft, Oracle, and RSA to pure play providers such as Okta, Ping and SailPoint. Selecting the best IAM product or service for your organization requires legwork to determine the features that addresses your needs such as centralized management, single sign-on, governance, compliance and risk analytics. That's all for this video. Thank you so much.